all right ladies and gentlemen so i was waiting to make this video because i wanted to make sure and see what the filler rate and whatnot is on these tickets but they caleb has dropped some black friday packs and the video today is why do they not drop packs like this all the time like I, this is basically just going to be a monetization video i think caleb needs to rework how they monetize their game because if you don't know if you go right over here to the little old pack screen and you scroll right down to i don't think you have to scroll down i think it's literally right here so this is basically 500 orbs it's like 510 if i'm not mistaken at 512 whatever it's 78 75 dollars after tax that's essentially two to three multis that's disgusting it's disgusting like if they made this and it was like okay now this is a whale talking 20 to 30 dollars more people will buy it you tell me i'm wrong that more people would want to buy this if it was 20 to 30 dollars kayla would make more money like, I think it's their worst idea ever of not improving the packs, or at the very least, when an end of month banner drops, drop a ban drop a sale saying, hey, guys, remember those packs that were $70? Boom, they're $30, go ham. And that's just, like, they, they could drop these packs. Like, here's a really cool character that a lot of people like, 6th Anniversary Eisen. He's still an incredibly broken character. He still does basically everything amazingly besides, like, go quest everything else he's really good in he's here for about a week um what is the filler pool that is what i'm curious like bro they're all good characters besides the gene i don't think he really has a use but asani she's a farmer he's a really good go quest character tense is an amazing unit he's better than these two i think aizen's a better farmer like in terms of like autoing stuff but tense best potion character in the entire game artwork ichigo is still an amazing character uh, Aizen, still an amazing character. There was another one, if I'm not mistaken. Or is it only this one? It's only this one? Because there was an, there was a Quincy Ichigo Black Friday pack leaked. Now, I don't know when it's going to drop or anything. But I'm curious, how much is the ticket? Like, they, they aren't saying... If I go to details... Oh, I don't even own Gein. Okay. Okay, so there's a bunch of stuff, so... It is a 40% chance to pull it, so I'm assuming this is a $10 ticket because we do have some of these like this in the shop. But even still, even if it isn't a 100% guarantee, people would still buy this if it's like $10 and it's one of the best cards in the entire game. Like, let me pull up the one from Spite's uh, leak server real quick. It's literally just this right here. We have this Quincy Ichigo image. And it's 66 orbs, 10 orbs, which is the less than this. So if I had to guess, it's with a character. And if you go to the shop screen, let me, that is the wrong one. If you go to the pack screen, so 66 orbs. Let's check the price on this real quick, just to check. Okay, so that's not it. Um, I'm looking for like one with like a character and I don't see one. So... I'm going to assume it might be around 20 buckaroos just because of the character on it. Uh, but like Quincy Ichigo for $20 and if he's guaranteed, obviously I doubt he is. I have to assume it's like maybe you pick and then you can like randomly get one of them. I don't know the filler on it. They have not shown that at all. Uh, we didn't know what the filler would have been on the, either of these two banners. We just kind of assumed that uh, it would have been a randomized one. And that's what I assume this is. But like... Let's say Caleb one day is like, you know what? Screw it. Here is a thousand year blood war. Really old character. Like, let's say uh, the Ichigo. The tech Ichigo or something. Just a really cool thousand year blood war character. $10. People would buy that. People would buy that. I, like, And it doesn't cost them anything to do this. Like, it, okay, maybe thousand year blood war does. I'm not sure how licensing works. But either way. You could do 7th Anniversary. Like, I don't think anybody would mind if you threw a 7th Anniversary Ichigo or Uryu in here for 10 to $20. Just trying to make some buckaroos. It's a video game. It's a gotcha game. It's trying to make money. It's not going to break the game if you throw in bundles like this every once in a while or every end of month. Just to try to get more money out of people. You're a gotcha game. We understand you are trying to take our money. 
but like why do you have to like rip out seven of our kidneys because obviously yes you should not buy these these packs right here are absolutely disgusting but i've had to buy one or two it feels awful it feels like they're stabbing you in the kidney at least 12 times and then stealing your fourth born child and saying hey by the way we're coming back for the third one so like they just need to monetize the game a bit better in terms of like lower the price and more people will buy it because i genuinely don't know how that how many people are buying these but it can't be that many like there's not that many people willing to just be like yeah you know what every banner i'll drop 80 to 200 dollars on orbs like then that's like four multis that's four multis i think it's like six technically if you like do you know the 150s and whatnot but like you know what i mean like i would genuinely like to buy you know more of these uh also why are these even here what what is this for why why are you like basically making fun of us by putting these crystals in here let's be real none of this is gonna do anything but you know i guess it's just to entice newer newer players just to be like, hey look at all these items in here but yeah i'm just curious what, what would you guys do to monetize the game in a fair way obviously i don't think we should get like eighth anniversary white ten dollars that's a bit much he's like brand new but like seventh anniversary i think is fair game i think it's fair game they're not the best character in the game anymore i think if you sell them 10 20 dollars or any character spirits are forever with you toshiro throw him in there you could literally do any goddamn character you want from like literally last year and i don't think anybody would realistically mind if it's just like hey it's a randomized pack go for it the people who want to take the risk go for it you could do a tensa obviously they're already doing quitting ichigo so they can do that uh they could do the renewed okiyora because why not he's just that broken imagine they throw this guy in there imagine he's on like a 40 dollar pack it's a one out of three chance or something people would unironically go for that one of these three characters obviously it's thousand of blood war so it might jack up the price or obviously much has never happened because it's a thousand year blood war but you get what i mean right like put popular characters in the shop try to get people to spend a like a few schmeckles here and there and just you know really inc increase your pockets caleb so that way we can entrust the future of the game you know what i mean like i would like to play this game to the 20th anniversary to be honest i like bleach i like the ip i like the game they just keep dropping funny characters and i'll i'll, I'll keep summoning you know like they could probably drop this ichigo for like five dollars and people would probably buy it it doesn't have to be super expensive you can just always have random cool looking characters in the shop for like five dollars and people will probably buy it people will probably buy these characters you know what i mean like that's just what i'm getting at you know make caleb or Caleb should put in packs that are cheap-ish to where people be like, do I want that? I, it's kind of cool, and it's like a guaranteed character, you know? Like, really old characters, like 4th Anniversary, you know, just put, like, Danga Ichigo in there. Somebody, some poor old schmeckle person would end up buying that just because it's Danga or Mugetsu or full uh, Vasto Lord of Ichigo. 5 to $10? And it's guaranteed because it's such an old character. It would never matter to anyone and they would buy it. That's just my opinion. Let me know down below what you guys think. Hope you guys have an amazing day. I, I, like, I just think it would really help, you know, Kale's pockets because they, w I want to give the game money so that way I can keep going, but I don't want to feel like I'm getting my kidney ripped out at 7 a.m. bleeding all over the floor. And you know, you, you know what I mean? You know, yeah, I think you get what I mean. Anyway, take care. Peace out and... Let me know what you guys think.